Hello, I bought the Stumac Triple O acoustic kit on sale for Black Friday. And today I thought we'd do a little bit of an unboxing, inspect the kit and see what kind of tools I probably am going to need to buy to complete this project. Uh, this will be my first ever acoustic guitar build. Um, I have previously built an ES335 also from Stumac. But other than that, I have zero experience. And here we go. <clears throat> this is the back rosewood. I got a pretty nice figuring on mine. Pretty happy with that. Perfectly matched. Pretty cool. Truss rod. Okay, here's our Sitka spruce top. It's a really thin top. Hmm. I don't know if this is doing anything, but I've seen I've seen luthiers do this before. Sounds good to me. All right, I have to move locations. There's too much stuff. But I have it all laid out here. We got the uh, Sitka spruce top, the rosewood back, some binding and metal stuff. I don't know what it is about instructions, two cardboard um, patterns. Here we got the rosewood back, sides rather. Um, I think this is ebony, ebony fretboard. And I believe this is a mahogany neck. I'm going to have to research that again. I forgot what kind of wood that is. And finally included in the kit, we've got some wood pieces, a blueprint, the dovetail joint, another piece of ebony, some wood, like a finger board uh, fret pattern maybe some more wood we got a truss rod some of the uh, knurling that goes inside the binding that goes inside I forget what you call these the flexible binding that goes inside the acoustic guitar we got some bracing pieces here and it comes with some uh, the finishing work, the pins, the uh, nut and the bridge. I'll have to shape these. We got inlays. There we go. Some more wood and uh, we got the uh, rosette right here. There we go. And a bunch of rubber bands and uh, more bracing. Got my work cut out for me.